<laughs> uh, so the trainers, the, the yeah. benefit about being on the backside is mm -hmm. we're back here with the trainers and the stables and the horses. Mm -hmm. And uh, similar to all of us in our regular lives, or many of us anyway, there are mm -hmm. superstitions that some of us yeah. hold on to. Uh, and and uh, some trainers definitely have that too. Absolutely. I'm not going to pretend to know all of the superstitions. I'm not going to speak on anyone's behalf. But I do know of a goat <laughs> in Brad Cox's barn, right? So today we are going to introduce you at home to Mr. Man. What does it take to be a goat, a greatest of all time? For Brad Cox, a first place finish on Derby Day could be the place to start. He's got one win with Mandaloon on a technicality last year with Medina Spirits DQ. Here's what he said about that about a week and a half ago. We're, we're good with just how it's played out and <laughs> it's, it's obviously very odd and just kind of <laughs> You know, we'll take it, but it's obviously we're look, looking forward to getting back and trying to win another one. Cox is Louisville's darling, a product of JCPS schools, a lifelong Churchill Downs visitor, working his way up from hot walker to hot talk at the betting windows. And with all the excitement and the drama of the track, sometimes... You just need a little chill. Our little goat, is, he's kind of famous now. I mean, he's uh, he gets a lot of attention. He He's a pretty intelligent goat, uh, but, you know, he's good to kind of have around the barn. Seems like some of the fillies really take to him. He uh, will lay with them throughout the day, and, and they just relax better with him around. And uh, he's, he's a good asset to have around. He's pretty popular. So the goat is a ladies' man, a free roamer, wandering the halls of the stable keeping an eye on everything. The all-knowing in the Cox barn. He knows this is home and we take you know, obviously good care of him and uh, he the, he's just was, you know, I can't remember exactly how old he was. He was very small when he when we brought him in here and he's been here for four or five years now and uh, you know, he knows this is home. On the backside of historic Churchill Downs, I am Haley Minogue for Good Morning Kentuckiana. That was such a fun story to do. It was so great to meet the goat and all that kind of stuff. Did you ever think in your professional career as a journalist with a Murrow that you would write the line, that goat is a ladies' man? <laughs> you gotta do what you gotta do. You gotta do what you gotta do. 